Hello and welcome to the world of recipe. This is Vaishali. Whenever my family is bored of eating reg uh, whatever reg regular vegetables I cook, they demand me to make something spicy. And today they have demanded for spicy egg curry. So I thought of sharing this uh, same recipe with you all. So quickly see the ingredients. Two medium sized onions roughly chopped. Desiccated coconut about two tablespoons. Some whole spices. 1 bay leaf, 1 cinnamon stick, cloves about 1 teaspoon, peppercorns about 1 teaspoon, soft or fennel seed about 1 teaspoon. Ginger garlic paste 1 and half tablespoon, coriander powder 1 tablespoon, cumin powder half tablespoon, garam masala about 2 teaspoon, salt as per requirement it's about 3 teaspoon, turmeric powder 1 teaspoon red chili powder 2 teaspoon or as per requirement 6 boiled eggs oil as per requirement here I am going to use about 3 tablespoon of oil coriander leaves as per requirement we need to make some preparation for the egg curry so let's start with the recipe hit the pan and first we will dry roast this uh, whole garam masalas all together these spices are nicely roasted now I'll take it out In a grinder jar. Let it cool down in the grinder jar itself and we'll grind it for a fine powder then. Now in the same pan I'm going to put some oil. About half tablespoon of oil I put. And now I'm going to put this onions. These onions are golden brown now. Now I'm going to add this desiccated coconut with the onions and roast it till it becomes brown again. I'm using desiccated coconut here. If you want, you can use fresh coconut as well. Now these onions are completely cooled down. Now let's take it out in a grinder jar. I'm going to use same pan for the curry also. Now as I'm grinding it, I'll put some oil in the pan and heat it again. I put about 2 tablespoon of oil here. As this oil is hot, put ginger garlic paste. As the ginger curry paste is cooked properly, I am going to put this ground onions and desiccated coconut. Mix them well together. As this masala is already cooked, we don't need to cook it further. Just cook it for one minute and that will be enough. Now after one minute of cooking, we'll put this whole spices powder. Okay. 
just mix it well put this coriander powder Now, at the end, I am going to put this garam masala powder. Mix it well with the other spices. And now, I am going to add <coughs> water. Put about 3 cups of water in this. That much will be needed to make the gravy thinner. You can wash this blender jar. And put this water in this. Now let this uh, gravy cook for about 5 minutes on low flame. Now this gravy is ready. Now we need to put this eggs inside. I always prefer to give one slit in between. And then put this egg so that the curry goes inside and gives nice flavor. And they let the curry boil with these eggs for one minute. Now it's done. Switch off the stir. Garnish this curry with some cilantro or coriander leaves. And serve it hot with any kind of bread or rice. This spicy egg curry is ready. Thanks for watching this recipe. For more recipes, keep on watching World of Recipes.